What's up everybody? We back with another video and today we're going to be talking about drift shots. Let's get to it. All right, so first up on our list, we're going to be looking at Fire King. Now Fire King's drift shot, it is spectacular, bro, because you are going to be getting distance plus 10 at level 2 and distance plus 10 at level 3. That is going to make you drift really far away, make it very difficult for your drift shot to get blocked. Now, Fire King's Drift Shot does not have anything special attached to it like Nana, Maggie, or uh, Greta. <laughs> but the fact that he has these passives right here helps his Drift Shot out a whole bunch, whether you like to believe it or not. So you look at his enhanced three points, that's 2% extra accuracy at level one. And then you get 5% disturbance resistance, and then you get 3% more accuracy at level three, and another 5% disturbance resistance. That's 10% disturbance resistance and 5% accuracy. And then you factor in the uh, full charge. When it's maxed out, you're going to be getting 15% extra accuracy. That's 20% extra accuracy and 10% disturbance resistance on a drift three-point shot with Fire King. Now that is a, a really good thing to have on any shooter inside of this game, especially someone like a shooting guard, bro, because those three-point shots nine times out of 10 will be getting a normal disturbance. So having extra accuracy to cancel some of that disturbance out, as well as 10% disturbance resistance to stack on top of that to cancel out even more of that disturbance is gonna really come in handy with these drift shots. All right, second up, we're going to be looking at Maggie. Now, Maggie's Drift 3 point is way better than Fire King's just because of the level 4. So uh, let's read it. She's going to be getting distance plus 10 at level 2 and at level 3. That's the same thing Fire King is getting. Now, I used to think she was getting speed and distance, but I was obviously confusing her with the Drift Mid-Shot users. So she's getting distance plus 10 on level 2 and level 3. That's beautiful, bro. It is also going to be very difficult to block her Drift 3 points if your defender just so happens to slip up a little bit on their defense. And the level four, increase shooting accuracy by 10% and increase disturbance resistance by 5%. So that's 10% extra accuracy and 5% disturbance resistance on her drift three-point shot. And then we take a look at the enhanced three-point here. As you can see, man, her enhanced three-point isn't nearly as good as Fire King's, bro. His is just so much better. But she is still going to be getting... 4% extra accuracy if she just so happens to be wide open and she is going to be getting that 10% I mean that 5% disturbance resistance that's going to stack on top of what she has already that is going to be 10% disturbance resistance 4% extra accuracy plus um, I believe she was getting 10 that's going to be 14% extra accuracy if she is wide open but only 12% extra accuracy if she's contested so make sure y'all keep that in mind uh, Fire King once his uh, passive is maxed out his drift three point is definitely better than Maggie's, but you factor in the fact that Fire King at his level three drift three point is going to need a total of five shots. Um, well, wait, is it five shots? He's getting 1.5 per, so he's going to need about, yeah, about five shots <laughs> for him to reach the same amount of accuracy that Maggie is going to be getting from this just for free <laughs> off of the level four on her drift three point. So make sure y'all keep that in mind, bro. Fire King, later on inside the game, after he's taken all those threes to max out his passive, is definitely going to have a better enhanced three-point than Maggie. But at the very beginning of a match, and for the duration of that match too, even if her three-point shot gets blocked, she is still going to maintain this 12% accuracy for free. All right, so third, we're looking at Mary, the last shooting guard um, drift shooter. We're going to take a look at her enhanced three-point. It is definitely not as good as Fire King's, bro. Once again, Fire King has the best enhanced three-point in the entire game. So let's read it. Increase accuracy of three-point shots by 2%. 5% uh, disturbance resistance at level 2. And 2% wide open accuracy at level 3. Now, I feel like Mary has the worst <laughs> drift three-point in the entire game because the only thing that she has to boost her accuracy is this enhanced three-point right here. So... This preemption right here doesn't do anything when it comes down to that drift three point. That drift three point is just going to make it easier for you to get that preemption off in the first place because that, those normal disturbances do not matter when you have zero points. So make sure you keep that in mind, bro. She has the worst drift three point shot in the entire game. As a matter of fact, I'm going to go on a whim here. I'm going to say she has the worst drift shot, period, in the entire game. Even Greta's is better. Even Julian's is just a million times better with all that extra accuracy and disturbance resistance he'll be getting. So she's only getting 2% extra accuracy and 5% disturbance resistance. I do not recommend using Mary inside this game, bro, unless they give her some kind of buff to her three-point shot. She is just not worth using right now. 
All right, so number four, we're looking at Nana. Nana's Drift 3 Point, it is beautiful, bro. Because at level four, if you are wide open, you are going to be getting 15% extra accuracy. Now, you look at someone like Fire King, when you have the level three unlocked and not the level four yet, it is gonna take him 10 shots to get 15% extra accuracy on his Drift 3 Points. But the thing about that, bro, is that Nana does not need to take 10 shots in order for her to get 15% extra accuracy on those Drift 3 Points. Yes, bro, she is going to be getting this for free. If her drift three-point gets blocked, she is still going to maintain that 15% extra accuracy if she just so happens to shoot a wide-open drift three-point. Make sure y'all keep that in mind, bro. Fire King gets 15% extra accuracy after a bunch of shots, and Nana just gets it for free. It's beautiful, man. I love it. I probably would have given her a pass-based ability for her level four, but the fact that the whole community sees her as a shooter more than a passer, this makes a whole lot of sense. All right, so second to the last drift shooter we're looking at. We're looking at Julian. Now let's take a look at his uh, drift mid shot. You can shoot while running, but your base shooting accuracy will decrease. At level two, drift distance plus 10. And level three, drift speed plus 10. So you're gonna be drifting faster and a little bit further away. I actually like having distance and speed a little bit better than I like having double speed and double distance. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention with Nana, she has double speed instead of double distance like Fire King, Maggie, and um, Mary. Make sure y'all keep that in mind, what that drift speed does. It makes it so that you're going to reach the end point of your drift just that much faster. And the fact that you're drifting much faster makes it that much harder for someone to catch up to you when you're doing a drift. So make sure y'all keep that in mind when you're using Nana. If someone is to your left or to your right trying to do a dribble move stop, then you should just go in the opposite direction with a drift three point. They will not be able to stop you. So back to talking about Julian, man. I'm sorry that I forgot to mention that stuff when I was talking about Nana. But we're going to look at the stuff that uh, basically contributes to his drift mid shot. So let's take a look at the hop step here at level two. It's going to increase your shooting accuracy by 3% after a hop step. And at level three, you're going to get another 3% extra accuracy for a total of 6% extra accuracy. And then at level four, you're going to get 15% disturbance resistance after a hop step. So that's 15% disturbance resistance and 6% extra accuracy when you do a um, hop step and then go into a drift mid shot. And then we're going to take a look at the shooting mastery right here. So increased accuracy of shooting skills on Julian in specific. That means the, the uh, fadeaway miss shot, the drift miss shot, the flash shot, the euro step, as well as the double pump. All of those are going to be getting those boosts from this ability right here. So let's read it. Increase accuracy of shooting skills. Increase the accuracy of shooting skills by 5% and reduce disturbance by 10%. So that is going to be a total of 25% disturbance resistance on a drift mid shot and 11% extra accuracy. So make sure y'all keep that in mind. You have to make sure you are doing a shooting base ability paired up with this shooting mastery. And there is no better shooting base ability inside of this kit than the drift mid shot. All right, last and certainly not least, we're going to be looking at Greta. So let's take a look at her drift mid shot. Her drift mid shot, you can shoot while running, but your base shooting accuracy will decrease. Level two, you get drift distance plus 10. And at level three, you get drift speed plus 10. And at level four, increase your shooting accuracy according to distance from the basket. What they mean by that is, the further away from the basket that you are, you are going to get even more accuracy. You wanna make sure you're hanging out next to the three point line with Greta, because that is gonna give you the maximum accuracy boost for this drift mid shot. And if you just so happen to lose your defender, you will be close to the three point line because she can also shoot from there. So let's take a look at her accuracy boost. She has enhanced mid shot. This is going to increase the consistency of her mid-range shots. So increase the accuracy of mid-range shots by 2% at level 1. That's a free 2% accuracy at level 2. Disturbance resistance plus 5% when you're doing a mid-range shot. So that's 2% accuracy and 5% disturbance resistance. And at level 3, if you just so happen to get wide open with Greta in the mid-range area, you will get an additional 2% extra accuracy for a total of 4%. Now, she also has a drift floater. <laughs> pairs really well with her drift mid shot bro because her drift mid shot it is one of the scariest shooting base abilities in the entire game so let's read it you can use double pump floater when making a mid-range drift shot but your base accuracy will decrease at level two increase disturbance resistance by two percent you pair that with her enhanced mid shot that is going to be a total of seven percent disturbance resistance you're also going to get two percent extra shooting accuracy and you pair that with her um enhanced mid shot that is going to be a total of four percent extra accuracy and seven percent disturbance resistance but y'all keep that in mind if you have been destroying them with drift mid shots the entire game switch it up into a drift floater they will not see it coming
All right, man, so that should just about cover everything. Just make sure y'all keep in mind, when you are using these drift shots, if someone is uh, directly to your left or directly to your right, just go in the opposite direction with a drift shot, bro. They will not be able to stop you. If you see them going to the steel animation, once again, just jump into a drift shot. They will not be able to stop you. Some people's drift shots are better than others. And I want to say this one more time, man. I do not recommend using Mary if you want to use a drift shooter. She has the absolute worst drift shot in the entire game. That's it. Now catch y'all on the next one.